It is now possible to migrate your last gen character over to next gen and keep both characters. This was posted up on Reddit by Thomas Dank and it said that he converted over his character and he didn't lose anything. And you can clearly see here it says you can continue to use your original GTA Online profile on your previous generation console and your progress on each will continue to be separate. I confirmed this as well on my PlayStation 4 by bringing over a character I created on PlayStation 4 into PlayStation 5 and I did have both characters available to use um, from that point on so yeah this is legit. This makes a lot of sense and now you're not getting penalized for transferring from last gen to next gen. Next gen and last gen can't play together so if you have a lot of friends that have last gen consoles you can't play with them on next gen consoles so this was a deciding factor for a lot of people to transfer over. Now I decided to transfer my main character a few months a year ago maybe and that would have meant that I had lost all the progress on my last gen. I never made a new character on the last gen for that so I logged back in and the story and went to start online and I could see there was a clown face which made me wonder maybe I did have a clown mask on when I transferred my character but no it loads me straight into you know, remake a character from scratch screen. It doesn't bother me hugely as I don't play GTA as much as I used to but I know there's a lot of people out there that did transfer over their characters and they have a lot of friends and stuff that play on last gen and they might be a little salty about this if they had to start building up a character from scratch while also keeping their main character as well like i mean i can definitely see people being salty about this as they were adding new vehicles and job mechanics to next gen it was obvious you weren't going to be able to mix that with last gen i mean even the different frame rates would have been an advantage but you should have still been able to keep your existing account and money on last gen. It, it really, really did turn a lot of people off um, upgrading onto next gen, which I think is the reason that they're doing this now. I suspect that they didn't get as many people upgrading to next gen despite all the GTA Plus benefits and crap that they throw at them. So they kind of realized, okay, maybe maybe people just don't want to lose everything they built up for years by transferring onto next gen where none of their friends play on so maybe we better let them keep their money on last gen also that way when a lot of people go okay i'm not losing anything and they upgrade onto next gen as well they get the report in their quarterly earnings yes there was an unprecedented amount of increasing uh, people adopting next gen you know, gta which means you know it's working so i suspect that's why they did it it'll look better under quarterly reports anyway let me know in the comments did you transfer or migrate your character over and do, do you care are you a little salty about it or have you been holding off and now you might transfer over as it's not gonna really make you lose anything Love reading your comments and getting your feedback, so I look forward to having a browse through them. Massive thanks to everyone who supports the channel, especially to the members. You guys are awesome. Alright people, catch you again.